Intelligence services have warned that the terror chief known as the Scorpion of Allah could be heading to Britain to mastermind a series of terrorist atrocities. It is believed he intends to link up with terror cells based in this country. Despite being hunted by police in 23 countries, the Scorpion has evaded capture for two decades. Thank you, Mr. O'Reilly. Enjoy your business conference. Famed as a master of disguise, the whereabouts of the Scorpion remain a mystery to security services on both sides of the Atlantic. Yoo-hoo! Mr. Scorpion! Mr. Scorpion, mate, over here! Yoo-hoo! You have done well, Omar Masood. You have clearly caused much devastation here. And of the thousand strong army of suicide bombers you spoke of in your email, I see that only you three brave warriors remain. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Scorpion of Allah. I've put you in the upstairs bedroom, and here's your hot water bottle. But I spurn the luxuries of the West. Just one night in a bed would fatally weaken my combat sharpness. I will sleep on the roof, on a bed of broken glass. All right, then. I'll get the guest broken glass out. What should we do now, our Scorpion? Tomorrow, we must prepare for Armageddon. Tonight, we shall relax our minds by watching TV. TV? Austin? You have heard of Al Jazeera? Is that near Egypt? Oh, it's a bit dull, this. Is there an Al Jazeera gold? Don't they have any, like, entertainment programmes? Of course. After this, it's time for... People say the most devout things. It's when people mean to say something holy. Only they say something much more holy by mistake. It is a laugh riot. <laughs> Forgive my followers, O Scorpion. They are young and have yet to realize the importance of spiritual edification in this godless society. Although Gordon Ramsay's kitchen nightmares is on UK food in ten minutes. Tomorrow there will not be a Gordon Ramsay. Tomorrow death will rain upon... Will rain... What is that bewitching smell? There you go, lads. Bernard Matthews microwavable nugget top pops oh. with Mackay mashed potato smiles. Oh, this decadent Western food. Tomorrow your training will begin with the art of disguise. Meet me at 6 a.m. by the fountains at the Queen Square Shopping Centre. Scorpion, is that you? It is I. I can blend inconspicuously into any crowd anywhere in the world. And you? We've come as the darkness. You said, come in disguise. I sense that we must go back to basics. I could hide neath the wings of the bluebird as she sings. The six o'clock alarm would never ring. But it rings and I rise, wipe the sleep out of my eyes. My shaven razor's cold and it stings. I must speak with the scorpion. It is time for him to light the spark that will set all Britain ablaze. Scorpion! It's a Mr. Cobra of death for you. Tell him I'll call him back at half time. So, Omar Masood, light of Islam, do away goals count double in the Carling Cup? I believe not. Then there is still hope that we can overcome the infidel Gillingham in the penalty shootout. Even though the infidel have had a man sent off, it is the super Jills who have compressed the play into midfield and taken the upper hand. Clearly, Allah moves in a mysterious way. Any pudding, lads? Oh, yes, please, Mrs. Khan. And may I say that the Mr. Greedy mini hot dogs in the ketchup were most appetizing. Mmm, yeah, marvelous, Mrs. Khan. 